King of the Road Productions proudly presents a special barbecue and boutiques episode of the King of the Road Show HD. Southeast Texas style. During the half hour, we'll preview the Deep East Texas State Barbecue Championships in Kirbyville. We'll cruise to So Adorable Two Children's Boutique in Beaumont and visit with owner Brenda Temple. We'll air the Southeast Texas debut of Troy Kemp's new video as our Max Bowl Music Clip of the Week. And singer-songwriter Frank Martin Gilligan will be back in the, in the Royal, Royal Spotlight. Spotlight. Sponsored by Pine Tree Lodge in LaBelle. King of the Road. Howdy, and thanks for watching the King of the Road Show HD on Fox 4, KBTV, and The CW. I'm Jim King of the Road. In addition to this weekly entertainment extravaganza, King of the Road Productions is home of King's Country, our streaming radio station at kingscountry.net. King's Country was launched with the Southeast Texas listener in mind, and you won't find a better country music mix anywhere on the planet. Never settle for less than the magnificent country music mix of King's Country at kingscountry.net. And don't miss the Deep East Texas State Barbecue Championships, taking place August 11th to the 13th at Magnolia Park in Kirbyville. Live entertainment on Friday and Saturday includes Midnight River Choir, Genevieve Allen, Jefferson Revival, Lee Pelly, Danny Dillon, and the Pegwinders. Now ride shotgun with me as we cruise to Magnolia Park in Kirbyville and gaze in the rear view at last year's Deep East Texas State Barbecue Championships. We always cruise Cadillac style, as seen on the Food Network's Log On and Eat with Eden Grinch Band. Extra large and turbocharged. It's the King of the Road Show. Oh, hi. One man has the power to take you behind the scenes. Jim King of the Road. Jim King of the Road. Last year, 45 barbecue teams from all over the Lone Star State converged in Kirbyville for the Deep East Texas State Barbecue Championships. I'm from Santa Fe, Texas. I'm the owner of Texas Select Seasonings, and this is my company, uh, my cook-off team, Texas Select Barbecue. And this is our uh, Juicy Pig ribs right here. They're finished up. We're getting ready to cut those and turn them in now. And the glaze that's on it is our salted vodka grapefruit glaze with smoked jalapenos. The event has grown in leaps and bounds from its 2014 inauguration and the proceeds go to the Kirbyville Youth Football Association. Second time we've done it and it's been a big success. We buy equipment, uh, help kids that are less fortunate get a chance to play the game of football. That is all different. We all get different kind of seasons. It's all depending on what you like. And it also depending on the cook-off, you know. Each place is different. So either they're gonna like the sweet, they're gonna like the spices. I like more spice than I do sweet, but it depends on the cook-off. And as we found out, it's serious business at an International Barbecue Cookers Association competition. In case you've ever wondered what it takes to be a certified barbecue judge, Here's head judge Jimmy Livingston of Biter. Well, I'm the uh, pit director over Third Coast for IBCA, and we run a lot of events in this area. In order to become a pit director or head judge, like the ladies are over there in the judging area, you have to train at a lot of events under a certified head judge, and after they feel you're qualified to run one or two, then we turn you loose on them. Uh, you start running the event, and uh, hopefully you get everything right and you get, loose, get turned loose to where you can do your own events, but still you're monitored from time to time. It's a lot of fun. Uh, we all start out as cook teams and eventually work our way up. Some want to just cook and some like running judging areas. Personally, when it comes to barbecue, I'm nothing more than an experienced connoisseur. 
A great time was had by all at last year's Deep East Texas State Barbecue Championships, a fantastic family-oriented event. Be at Magnolia Park in Kirbyville on August 11th through the 13th for great food, music, and fun while helping a very worthy cause. Still to come, we'll air the Southeast Texas debut of Troy Kemp's new music video as our Max Bowl Music Clip of the Week. Also, singer-songwriter Frank Martin Gilligan will be back in the, in Royal, the Royal Spotlight. Spotlight. Sponsored by Pine Tree Lodge in LaBelle. But next, we'll cruise to So Adorable 2 Children's Boutique in Beaumont and visit with owner Brenda Temple. King of the Road. Stay connected with the King of the Road Show at jimkingoftheroad.com. Winner of the best design, content, and broadcast internet video at the Press Club of Southeast Texas Excellence and Media Awards. There's plenty to do, see, and stream at jimkingoftheroad.com, including King's Country Internet Radio, segments from this TV show, the contest page, and King's Photo Gallery. Also, click on links to Jim's YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter pages. That's jimkingoftheroad.com.